Understanding the parallax effect in ClickFunnels can be a bit confusing, so I'm going to share with you a tutorial and some awesome tips. Okay, here's a site that I'm working on, and the parallax background looks like this. So you can see that the background here is this dude, and it stays there. It doesn't scroll with the rest of the content. So, uh, how to do that? Let's go ahead and jump into ClickFunnels. Do, do, do. There is a little bit of a hiccup, and so that's why I'm doing this tutorial. Uh, right now, early 2018, um, I think it's kind of a glitch that ClickFunnels has. All right, so here we are in the back end of ClickFunnels, and if you go to settings and change your whole background to an image, like the parallax thing, you can go here, you choose the image, boom, add image, then this is where it gets complicated. You can see all your options are right here. It says full center, fill 100%, no repeat. Well, I don't want to repeat. I don't want any of this. I want the parallax. I want it to stay put. Well, you think there's be like a go-to, quick, easy thing. There's actually not. Um, that's right. There's not a way to set it up on the background this way. So the way around it, guys, little tip. I'm gonna go back. We're gonna turn this, get rid of this. You have to create each section with a parallax. So we're gonna do this section. You will see it actually already has it in there. It's the image, and this is the full center parallax. So once we change that, uh, that. So once we change that section, we have to do another section. And once again, you're going to want to do full page. Um, so right now, there's one section. Two section, three section, four section. So one and two have the parallax. I'll show you on this. Boom, there it is. And when you go to preview it, you'll see that these connect. This parallax is connected to this parallax, making it stay in one position. It's not glitchy at all, it's just keep that picture right in one position. It's pretty cool because you can make your parallax um, included in your menu, uh, just like it is on my website. Start funnels here. Here's a parallax. Um, it almost looks like there's not a top header, but there is. You can see that. See how it's scrolling down? Uh, looks pretty sweet, right? So my parallax is actually at the top there. Ooh. All right, guys, that is it for you. I hope you enjoyed this quick tip with how to use Parallax with ClickFunnels. If you liked it, you know what to do. Give it a thumbs up. Please subscribe if you'd like to see more videos. Comment if you have any questions. Tip that bell icon if you'd like to be notified. And if you'd like to receive a free guide on learning more tips and strategies with sales funnels, click on the link below. It is Start Funnels dot com forward slash guide and that will give you a free guide so that's it for you have an awesome day